At the age of 14, my shoe size was a size 3 and uh, my weight was uh, 29. The height was 140. Everything that I was wearing was from a kid's side. Ordinary kids at school, they were teasing me a bit, uh, calling me you know, short boy and all that. Being a jockey, I think it was the biggest luck that I ever had. I'm from Durban, uh, in a township, uh, Guamashu, and uh, life growing up there, it was, uh, yeah, it was hard. Uh, my mother, uh, she was a domestic worker, and my father at that time, uh, uh, he passed on. I became interested in horses uh, when there was a gentleman uh, that was sent by academy. He came to, to my school about and uh, he was looking for a guy or that was actually my, my height and my shoe size and uh, the weight. They called me up in the class and then I went to a principal's uh, office and I did the measurement and everything was perfect. I thought to myself, wow, you know, uh, was this horse racing thing? And you know what, I was a little bit terrified because I've never seen a horse before. And uh, even getting close to, to one, you know, uh, I was nervous. Everything about it was big and, uh, you know, but uh, you know what, they're very nice creatures. But once you get to know them and get to understand them, and they understand you and um, you can uh, make a, a nice friend, you know, with them. When I went to the Jockey Academy, uh, that's where I started uh, actually getting uh, uh, my confidence and uh, I got a lot of rides from there. Horse racing is changing. Um, you know, from uh, my year until, until now, there's so many other uh, young black riders that are uh, up and coming. You know, uh, if you are a hard worker, it will pay off. Three weeks ago, um, I was uh, racing in uh, uh, the Vodacom Deb in July, one of the richest races in South Africa. And it's been going for 116 years now. Heavy metal, heavy metals wanted. Run for a second. Do you remember third? No worries, and Jet Explorer. What a terrific run from heavy metal. Heavy metal, Smanga Kamala. Once again, he's risen to the occasion. Making history and. Uh, being the first black uh, uh, jockey to win it, you know, uh, it's, it's just greatest feeling ever, you know. Um, I was electrified, I had, uh, I had electricity all over. Uh, if I had wings, I would, have fl I would have flown like a bird. It meant a lot to me and it meant a lot to uh, a whole lot of people, a whole lot of up and coming uh, guys that want to be jockeys, you know. At least they can look up and say, there's a guy that uh, uh, put us on the board, you know. And uh, I didn't do it for myself, I did it for the whole of South Africa. You know?